I'm with Wesley DeSantos. We are at the International Surfaces Event East, which I have the hardest time saying for some reason or another. Wesley, how you doing? Very good. Now, you are at this show. You're not even in the floor business. You're in the counter business. That's right. This you came all the way from Washington to, to, to come to this show. It's exactly. We come from Seattle to see uh, the new equipments, uh, everything uh, related with uh, countertops. Tell me about your business. How long have you been in business? Uh, 25 years. Okay. And you wanted to come to Miami in a worse way, right? <laughs> it's a beautiful place. Spend a little time on the beach? Yeah. And, and we're going to be here for like a week, vac like a vacation. Okay. Enjoy the city. This is a great city. Isn't it? That's right. And Especially, your weather isn't noted for being absolutely great up there, is it? <laughs> yeah, it's, we got a lot of rain, and we like to uh, enjoy this sun time here. Uh -huh. now, are there people in your business that are in the floor covering business, that you, or, or people you're associated with? Yeah, we, my uh, family started on business in 1986, and we follow our family, and yeah, we're very happy with the work we've done in Washington. Okay. Now it would seem to me a lot of times if people are redoing part of their kitchen, they're going to do all of their kitchen, including the floor. Would that be, uh, would that be a good assumption? Yeah, it's, there's an option. Like we more concentrate on countertop, but the, definitely a floor. It's a huge business in Seattle, Washington. And yeah, maybe on future we, we can think about it. Talk about the countertop business. Uh, does it differ all that much from uh, from the flooring business? Um, no. Uh, actually, we have done floor like uh, 10 years ago, but after the economy changed, we decided to stay just on the countertop. But it, it's still a very good business. Okay. Now, have you ever thought about getting into cabinetry and other things uh, as well as, um, as, as, as well as counter? We already very extremely busy uh, with doing countertops. I don't believe we can uh, uh, go in different direction right now. Okay. now. Tell me about the, 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 the hard part about getting in that business. I mean, I guess you cannot make a mistake. Yeah, the reason we're here on the show is try to uh, find the best way to uh, get a, a precise and like find a product for the customer. Um, we, if, if you have to uh, like uh, invest more on business, this is the way we think it's, we're going to go us more and more. So you're really here to what? Look at machinery or, or basically raw material? I'm here to look at the machine, machine side. So, so the machine that you have, is that, is that getting old or what's, what's the situation there? Like the, the technology, it's on the front door and you have to change no matter what. Okay, so you need another piece and that's... Yeah. And more production. The new equipment, they get more production also. Are you going to buy something here? Yes, I will. Oh, you will? Uh-huh. So you've been over there talk, you're talking to them? I'm surprised they let you leave. Yeah, I talk with the uh, park industry. I talk with the uh, Northwoods. And one of those uh, is going to be the place we're going to spend the money. Several years ago, I redid the countertops in, in my home. And I had a guy measure it. He, he was a worker for this particular organ, this particular contractor. And he called me up and he said he wanted to come measure it again. And I canceled it. <laughs> was, that, was that a wise thing for me to do? Yeah, with the, those uh, new equipments today, uh, everything basically it's made uh, digital. Um, you don't use like the strip woods more. It's the old school. And... With those machines we, uh, we're going to buy today, it's like the new generation on the countertop. It's like you push on the button and everything happens. So that means the measure is absolutely the most important That's right. thing. That's right. And you have 
have that down to the hundreds or thousands of an inch? <laughs> exactly. So it's, how do you, I mean, that, that would seem, I mean, you can't let somebody who doesn't know what they're doing go out and measure, can you? Oh, yeah, it's a lot of unlicensed people are doing the work we do, um, unfortunately. Um, but that's why we're here, because I believe with the technology, with the technology we can go over those people. Because you have to, where you have a joint, that has to be absolutely perfect. That's it, right. We offer uh, our customer um, ability to uh, match veins, um, a Cowboy slab is met. When you put it together, two pieces together, it's everything going the same way. What's the most popular material that that you install these days? Uh, granite. Granite's more popular, but it's a huge market for quartz right now. Uh, like for look, modern look, but people are still uh, doing more granite than anything else. And, and in terms of the life of the product, is granite the best choice? Yeah, I'm an origin from Brazil. Um, uh, we born doing granite. We're here for 23 years. Um, I have, we have done like a, over then a 10,000 uh, jobs, 100% complete. And I saw most people happy with granite. If you were a retailer, in the floor covering business, or somebody who is who is contemplating getting into the countertop business, what would you recommend to them? Say, say if they're thinking about it, they've been in the floor covering business for a long time. Would that be a wise move for them? Um, we work for another contractors. We the same way uh, people uh, uh, recommend us. We we recommend the different contractors also. It's how it works. It's a mouth by mouth. What would it cost for somebody to get in the business if somebody wanted to expand into uh, countertops? It sounds like it cost them a, a good uh, hunk of change for the, um, for, for the machine. Like uh, granite business, it's like a well, universe. You can spend $20,000 and like me, you can come here and spend five hundred thousand dollars, and and only one call. It's how it works. Depends on where you need to go. You like to go. Okay. You're gonna spend that much? Yeah, I will. Wesley, well, I appreciate you uh, you you talking with us. Thank you very much, and and enjoy your uh, enjoy your trip here. I'm Thanks. sure I'll see you down on the beach later, right? I will. Wes so Wesley De Santos. His company is in town. in town. He is out of Auburn, Washington. And this is Talk Floor TV.